What is going on guys? It's Mr. Hoots here today, back with just just probably the sweatiest, dirtiest, most disgusting squad that I have ever built. Now I've been hearing a lot, a lot, a lot of hype about this one ridiculous Italian striker. Now that player is a Serie B player called Marco Sau and he just has ridiculous pace. And what we're going to be doing today, we're going to be just building just a nasty, sweaty, dirty Italian squad using the 4-4-1-1 formation that I guarantee you will just absolutely wreck people across any division that you play in. Not only that, it's only going to cost you just over 10k. Wow. Okay, so up first we kick things off in goal with a guy called Perrin. He might look like Shaggy out of Scooby-Doo, but 90 reflex, 750 coins, what more do you want for just a, a real solid goalkeeper? Now, moving on to the left back, we have a player called Crisito. Uh, Crisito is a fairly good left back. You can pick him up for 650 coins, so discard value. He plays over in the Russian League, 82 pace, decent defence, 79 defence, uh, and just a solid, solid guy to have in the, the back four there. Uh, Centre-back pairing is a Juventus player called Brazagli. Um 88 defense, 75 pace, just a just an absolute solid monster. Um, I'm pairing him up with a West Ham uh, centre back. He is Ogbonna. Uh, Ogbonna's got 83 defense, so uh, you know really rock solid and still 73 pace. So uh, a really really bargain centre back there for 700 coins. So in right back we have a player called Arabate. 92 pace. This guy is just a monster. Absolutely rapid. His defending leaves a little bit to be desired, but, you know, who's complaining when you've got 92 pace? Now, in the centre midfield position, we have a player from Juventus called Storaro. Um, a decent all-round player. He can be picked up for 700 coins. He's got good pace, good passing, decent physical, decent defence. Uh, you know, not, not really that bad of a player, to be honest. Uh, we've paired him up with a AC Milan defender called... Bonaventura. Um, Bonaventura is a, a pretty exciting player. He had good pace, good dribbling, a decent shot, um, got forward for me, passed the ball around. Um, you know, I picked him up for 650 coins and really enjoyed playing with him again and, and probably one of the fastest centre midfields uh, in Syria. Uh, over on the right side, we have a player called Baradi. Um, picked him up for 650 coins. Arguably one of the best right-sided players in the league outside of Cadrado. Um, he's got 87 pace. 83 dribbling. What more do you want from a winger? He gets forward, you know, creates the plays and, and, and very good player. Um, over on the left side, we have a just a beast of a player who plays over in France, um, El Shorari. Um, probably the most expensive player that I, I bought for this team. Um, I paid 1,100 coins for him, but 86 pace, 84 dribbling. Uh, you know, a, a fairly solid player. Four-star weak foot, four-star skill move. Just just a good, good, good all-round player. Now, at centre-forward, we have a player called Sebastian Javinko. Um, I love this guy. Um, got him for 900 coins, played four games for me, scored five goals, 90 pace, 85 dribbling, 77 shot, just a, just a monster. Um, and I paired him up with the man himself, uh, Marco Sau. Now, Marco Sau is only 75 rated, but just, a, a, just an absolute OP monster. Uh, 94 pace, 83 dribbling, and... 74 shot, but it's just not true. Every time he gets on the ball, hits it, scores. Every time, he's just a, a quality player. And I picked him up for 700 coins, played four games with him, scored four goals. So between him and Javinko, four games, nine goals. What more do you want? This is just the sweatiest, sweatiest team I think I have ever put together. And just, just a very, very OP team. Now, what we're going to go ahead and do now is we're going to jump into the highlights that I picked up with this team. If you like this video, smash that like button. Remember to subscribe for more squad builders, pack openings, all that good stuff. Peace. And, uh, in an effort to stop that, this player who won't just be able to plug some gaps. We've had a lot of transfer whispers, haven't we, about the goalkeeping position here. And there's a new man in between the posts today. Aaron, here is a keeper that likes to... Well, it could be it.